We're going to keep the show moving right along. A very funny lady. Please give it up for Danielle Davison.
really truthfully, it's me. Um, so my other question is, who's married here? Like, where are my married people at? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yes. You guys are so stinking happily married, and that just makes me sick. God, it makes me sick. Gross. I work in the wedding industry, and um, you know. I uh, I know what you guys are doing and it's not fooling anybody because really, <laughs> really truthfully, like the honeymoon phase, it wears off, okay? It doesn't last that long. We all know that. <laughs> yeah, and it's really stinking cute though when it happens, right? Sick. You guys are all sick. Uh, so, you know, have you guys ever seen two people that you wonder like, how the... How did, how did they get together? You know, like, she was like a 10, you know, and he's like a two, you know? Well, it's the size of his wad. <laughs> wad is a lot of cash, right? Money? No? Wad? All right. You guys are great. <laughs> yeah. So, I have this problem. Um, I've been talking it out with my therapist, and um, don't judge me, okay? You guys all have one. You're it's Orange County, let's be for real. Uh, so, I don't know if you've heard of the term, like a serial dater, you know, it's when you go from one person to the next person to the next. Well, I don't have that problem. <laughs> no, 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 no. I have what's called clinically diagnosed as a serial fixer upper. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so I like to go from one messed up guy to the next messed up guy, fixing him up for the next girl to come along so she can be the one to marry him. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, why do I do this? Why? Why do you ask? Well, well it's kind of like, it's kind of like flipping a home, you know? Yeah. Like you find like the worst house on the block. It's, it's just what happened, right? So like the worst house on the block. And then you, uh, Fix up the exterior, you know, you give it some great curb appeal, and then um, I like to fix up the electricity. <laughs> Make sure the switches turn on and they turn off. <laughs> oh yeah, and then I fix up the plumbing, right? Because you gotta make sure all the pipes work really well. <laughs> it's great, and then I get rid of it. I sell it, you know, put it back out on the market. Yeah, and I have this ability to take a guy who is a two, and I can turn him into a 10. I really can, you know? And I love, I love knowing that I'm helping this world out. Just one idiot asshole at a time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's great. So, my dad was talking to me recently about my finances, you know? <laughs> And uh, I decided to get these. <laughs> these, I got my goose back. Yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you. They're an investment, really, really. Um, I've already seen a great ROI on these things. <laughs> yeah, the right one, it's already paid off. Uh, three different trips in Hawaii and uh, Missouri. Uh, Mississippi or Montana. Um, and then I've already gotten, you know, that one done. Now I'm just working on the left one. So, yeah. And you know what? My dad would be really happy tonight because now that I talked about my boobs, they're a tax write off. And then I'll never see you guys, otherwise, I'm so cute. Well, I'm going to